Hi, Geo Gypsy here. And you know, lately I've been feeling really grounded. I'm not talking about not centered. That's not too bad. It's not terrible. It's not great. I just feel grounded. And grounded to me is that I'm tied down because I can't travel right now. You know, it's summer. Yeah, my first summer after retirement. I'm trying to figure that out. I thought I was going to be traveling. That doesn't seem to be happening. Um, I'm also trying to figure out what I'm doing with my life if I'm not traveling. And, of course, with fuel prices the way they are and not a steady income, I'm also thinking about finances just a little bit. Speaking of fuel, I know I'm not the only one who's been kind of grounded about that. The price of fuel is crazy. Uh, you know, my truck, it gets about 13 miles per gallon. It does carry my home uh, on its back when I'm rolling, and I do like that a lot. You know, I've also got to deal with a few other things. I think there's some learning curves going on this summer, big time, over and above the retirement, life, finances, everything else. Not traveling. If I mention that, it's bumming me out that I'm not traveling. Yeah. Uh, you know, I've been an Arizona resident for over 20 years, but I've only spent one summer below 8,000 feet in elevation. You know, above 8,000 feet summer, well, the hottest day for a few is 95 degrees, so not terribly hot. More learning. There's a huge learning curve going on this summer, isn't there? I am uh, trying to get up earlier in the morning. You've got to. If you want to beat the heat, you want to do anything outside, trust me, you have got to be up early. And, you know, I guess I'm really glad I have these big windows because that means that I can still see the outside while I'm stuck inside with the, oh, I hate to say it, air conditioner. Yeah, it's running from eight in the morning till 8 at night now for the last several days as it inches up close to 100 degrees. That's got fans going, and you know, it's keeping me about 15 degrees cooler uh, inside the fifth wheel. But you'll also notice behind me there is a light shade down over the window. Um, you know, anytime the sun beats on the windows, I'm trying to reduce that amount of heat too. And speaking of heat, well, you know, dealing with summer temperatures that are very warm means summer clothes. And you know, for the last 29 years, my summer clothes have pretty much included a National Park Service uniform. Yeah, so I had to go out and kind of buy some summer clothes this year. And I'm a thrift store buyer, you know, so I went there, but wow, when did uh, thrift store prices get to be more expensive than Walmart? Ouch, not even a whole lot of luck. Well, another thing I'm kind of missing out here on, because I'm not traveling, I think I mentioned that, right? Yeah, not traveling, um, is that that's normally what my YouTube channel would be about, would be about the places I was going. So instead, because it is a new channel, and here I am sitting at home not traveling, is that I'm trying to learn how to create the YouTube videos. I want things that are fun helpful, educational, and entertaining. You know, I did that as a park ranger. I should be able to do it in real life. So, as of right now, I'm using some new tools because I'm talking to you not only in my telephone, but it is being held in my new combination selfie stick tripod. And I'm also using a new microphone that slips into the end, a little ball of foam on the end that's supposed to reduce noises. So I hope you're not listening to the air conditioner like I am right now. So yes, I am feeling grounded. I keep telling myself it's not forever. I'm going to get past this, and well, you never know, if I get a few things done this month, well, maybe next month, I'll be able to go traveling, and get to a higher elevation so I can be cooler too, and maybe not feel <sighs> quite so grounded.